Welcome back, everybody. This is so exciting to have you two here. Ground Floor Murals. Uh, if you haven't heard of them, you've seen their work around San Diego. Sina and Paul, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having us. It's so wonderful. And you have something really special that you've created. Another thing to add to your growing <laughs> list of, you know, really community-inspiring type of work that you do. Uh, so let's talk about that first, because we have your cans right here. We showed them during the tease, and it just looks so good. This is Tony Gwynn. Mm -hmm. So tell us, what's this project? Yeah, we, we were like so honored that they asked us to, to collaborate with them on this project. They're doing this San Diego inspired beer, and I think they're only having a limited drop at the Ale Smith uh, Taste House. Nice. So, but it was really cool. They asked us to, to come together and, and make this with them, and, it, and it's just, it's been a, I was, I was just so touched that they asked me yeah. to. Yeah. I mean, for, so this is obviously an image of Tony Gwynn that you came up with, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, this is from his 2000 hit. Okay. So when he was celebrating uh, and getting honored by the fans at that uh, first base, yeah. this was a photograph that was taken, or it's from the video, actually. Okay, yeah, I see you. I'm looking at this side. So 2000 hit, and then obviously coming together, you have the two cans side by side, but you can see it on both sides. And th this one's actually the, so the 2000th, and this is the 3000. Oh, you have a 3000th hit. I was yeah. going to say, <laughs> yeah. so he racked him up. Yeah, <laughs> a triple. triple. A double and a triple. So, I mean, it, it definitely will get the party started. Oh, that's great. <laughs> and we know Ailsmith, I mean, they have a lot of Padres themed beers, a lot of great collaborations. So it's neat to see them collaborate with Ground Floor Murals, with artists. This yeah, is we, awesome. we, were, we were so touched. Yeah. It, was, it was really awesome. I love that, because you've done so much for San Diego, I will wow. say. In the past couple years, your name has really taken off. Um, I've seen your work, and I've kind of been like stalkery your Instagram, <laughs> a little obsessed with all the things that you've come up with. Nice. We're uh, showing our viewers some video, too, of some of this in case they've missed it. But cool. tell us how you took off. Osina, let's start with you. How did all of this come together? Uh, it was right in the middle of the pandemic. We had nothing to do, so we took advantage. Um, we had both been artists mm -hmm. casually, okay. and we decided we needed to take it to the next level uh, and get professional with it, and we just started doing this. Yeah. So murals, I mean, that's a, definitely a different type of art form mm -hmm. more than like regular painting, I yeah. would imagine. Uh, yeah. So that seems intimidating, not going to lie, I'm kind of afraid of heights. So how do you do that? How did you go from artist to muralist? Uh, we wanted to have the biggest amount of impact as okay. possible. And murals, they're public, it's for the people. Um, yeah, they're free to see. It's, and then also it's like, fine art for people right. who might not have the chance to go into a museum or anything like right. that. Right, that's true. You're turning San Diego into this museum that we can walk and drive by and see your work. <laughs> we're, we're I trying. love that. We're trying our best. <laughs> I, I remember when we were uh, live at the Joe Musgrove mural. Uh, so that really got your name out there more. Tell us what that was like. I mean, to see something so, I mean, he's large and in charge as it is, and then to be able to be part of that. It, it was, again, such an honor because, you know, the San Diego kid, the San Diego, it just was like, it felt so right. You know, it was, we didn't even know that mural was gonna happen right away but it, that moment happened and then we got a call I was like okay we're doing this and then like I think 30 hours from when he pitched that it was done and it that was, was done and that was like it was just so it was just such a rush like it, I think we slept four hours within those 30 wow. hours and it, was, it was just such a really cool time oh, I didn't realize the backstory that yeah. you had to rush and get that on that yeah. giant wall well I mean that, yeah, yeah we were so player. eager yeah how do you sleep when that's the request that is made yeah. <laughs> his no hitter he's uh, pitching tonight or today it's a day game we all get to be out there doing the first pitch and cool. it's just so neat to see San Diego coming together in the name of the Padres uh, and that's such a big goal of yours right to bring mm -hmm. San Diego together tell us why that's important to you so so we started this mural business just we I wanted to put something out there at the like the heat of like just like everyone was kind of feeling down everyone wasn't mm -hmm. feeling, feeling very good and I thought you know who would make everyone feel better and remind us all why we're why we love San Diego is a Tony Gwynn yeah. so I so I, I set out to paint a Tony Gwynn I said does anybody <laughs> have a wall I'll do this for support supply costs, no, like no big deal. And then this guy hits us up, uh, William, and, and he uh, said that I have this wall, so we show up and it's huge. <laughs> and I did not think it was gonna be this big, so, but I look at Cena, I was like, we got this. And this is yeah. our first time ever painting a portrait wow. and ever painting it something that big. Wow. And, and I didn't it, know we got it, but we Got it. <laughs> yeah, it, it was just, amazing. we had a lot of pressure, but it, it worked out. You know? oh, it goes to show, you're, this is your calling. I mean, you're meant to do this. This giant wall is like there for you. Yeah, <laughs> and we love it. I mean, yeah. It's two years later and we're just still loving it. And together. So when did you two meet, by the way? 
2019. Oh, not that yeah. long ago. Right? And then yeah, pandemic sorry. hits. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. What a life-changing time. And totally. really, San Diego appreciates the work that you do because oh. you're bringing joy. You're bringing smiles. And you're right. It was a, it was a tough time That's in 2020. Uh, yeah, so hopefully we're coming out of that and we get to celebrate with good beer. Uh, real quick, we have like 30 seconds. Uh, okay. This Saturday, uh, people can come out and get this. It's mm -hmm. at Ale Smith, yeah. Okay, go yeah. to Ale Smith Saturday. Get this. This is going to be one of those limited edition, very special things. I would not want, even want to open the can, <laughs> but I'm sure it's good inside. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Beautiful. Thank you very much, Cena and Paul, for being here. Uh, Thank you. Real quick, what's your next work? Where can we see it? So we're actually working on a really big one on the 5 Freeway if you're going, or just the 5 Freeway off of Logan. It's okay. a large uh, Jaguar. It's like four stories nice. tall, just a Jaguar portrait. Wow. I'm really stoked on Okay, that so watch for them painting along there. <laughs> That's yeah. going to be awesome. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. We'll be right back after this quick break.